Okay, for today's video, we're going to be opening up four total Pokemon Scarlet and Violet Obsidian Flames booster packs. So, pretty excited to open these. These are pretty cool. I just started getting back into Pokemon, um, and I'm, I'm really excited to, you know, start building a cool little card collection. I don't play Pokemon. Um, I never, I ne I've never played Pokemon before. So I don't really understand like the s strategies or anything like that. Um, I did. I was a really huge fan of the um, cartoons back back in the day. So I remember I'd watch them all the time. And as I've said before, I used to um, get Pokemon cards, get my hands on some Pokemon cards because uh, I liked drawing them. And that's really what what got me excited. But anyway, really cool Charizard art. I love it. And then it's a uh, looks like there's a Charizard um, art on this on this paper too, or the booster pack. I'm not sure if it's you know means there's a special card in there, but I think at least from all the all of the packs that we've opened so far on this channel, um, I'm a big fan of a lot of the cards we've come across. So I'm just pretty lucky to be able to do this and. You know, start start building something fun for myself, and hopefully my kids later on. Anyway, we have this open. All right, and you know what? I should have probably do done more research on the um, hat tricks with these. I keep seeing videos of um, other people opening up the Pokemon cards, and they're awesome. Uh, if, if you're watching this video and you're one of those people that makes um, opening videos, uh, you guys like rock. I, I watch you guys' videos all the time. If I haven't seen your video, more than likely it's just a matter of time before I watch it. Um, that's actually kind of what probably got me back into Pokemon really was watching uh, a lot of those videos. Um, anyways, it looks like we've got a young goose. Oh, no way, a Charmander, oh my gosh. This card, guys. So obviously, I know it's not the like original, original art, um, but I always wanted a Charmander. That was that was a card that I never had, and actually, I never had the Charmander, Charmeleon, or Charizard ever before in my life. So it's super, super cool to be able to own this card. It's really awesome. That couldn't have made me happier. Now let's check out what other cards are there are. So we've got a Dratini. It looks like. Man, I'm digging this art. And then some an Oddish. I remember this Pokemon. And here we've got another Trevenant. Um, I'm not sure if it's the same art. I believe it might be the same art as the other card. So we've got that. That is some cool art. Oh, an Electros. And it looks like it's, it's a stage two Pokemon. So that's cool. Give me one moment, guys. Sorry, my one of my dogs is going crazy. Come here. Come here. Ah uh ah. -uh. Hey. Stop. It's okay. Go lay down. All right. Sorry about that, guys. So we've got an Electros and a Flamigo. I think we've pulled this Flamigo card before. Okay, and it looks like we were, are on the um, foil cards. I'm, I'm not sure if that's what they're called, so if you guys know, please comment below and let me know. I, I usually call these foil, foil, ah, foil and hollow cards. I think that they're, you know, used in the same in, in sync, I guess. And I guess if I'm really curious about it, I can always Google it after this video. Uh, but a snub bowl, this is a cool card. I remember this one too. Oh my gosh, and guys, look at that cool art. That's just so cool. I've always been a fan of this Pokemon, the Togepi or Togepi. I, I, I forget. Please let me know again um, in the comments. But I've been a big fan of the way that it looks just because of the design. It always reminds me of like something really artsy so it's really cool to see and let's see what that hollow is going to be in the back looks pretty already and all right we got this card yesterday it's a scissor or sizer and oh, there's another card okay it looks like it's just the base energy so you know what i think there's an energy card 
as the last card I ev on every deck so far if my mind serves me correct. So that might actually be the hat trick. I guess we're su you're supposed to pull the last two cards um, from the deck up front. Okay, so we just opened this cover art here. We were fortunate enough to have a little Charizard packet, which is cool. And it came with a Charmander card, super exciting. Now let's move on to the other art. And guys, I'm a really big fan of this art. I, I really, truly am. Like, it's just, it's so cool. I think it's such a fun time to be getting into Pokemon because I get to come across cool art like this. And these cards are, if anyone knows of a better way to open these, please let me know. So I want to try to preserve the box um, just because I like the art on it. I guess I could just continue opening them how I'm opening them and just trying to be careful, I guess. But let's see here. Okay, this is cool. So there were some other booster packs like this um, there that had this Pokemon on the cover art. I didn't get it because it's not the traditional Charizard. Um, I know that the cover art might not necessarily have anything to do with what cards are inside. But anyways, it's cool to come across a booster pack that that is, uh, you know, with this character. Whoever this character is. If you do know his name, um, or its name I should say, because uh, it's a Pokemon, uh, please comment and let me know. Um, I'd really appreciate that. Let's see here. Okay, I, I guess I should have done the hat trick. Well, I, I mean, I'll just pull them from the back. So there's that. And boom, basic water energy. That's a cool card. Now I think I have all the energy types. Um, of energy oh, and I accidentally lifted the card up back there I didn't really get a chance to see it because I saw it with my peripherals but if you guys saw it on the video I do apologize I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go back and um, try to try to lift it and see what it was so um, this is a Vulpix we got that card before a fan trump pretty cool this is another really neat card in the trick or treat or I'm sorry trick or trade uh, packs that's really awesome Man, I'm just digging the art on these. There's a Buzel, or Buzel, another Whooper, a Bell Awesome, Pokemon League Headquarters. That's cool. All right, we've got a Lunatone and a Glamette. I think we have this card already, but that's pretty awesome. And a Steeny. Okay, and the final Pokemon card. I think it was blue, so I think it might be a water Pokemon. Wow. A palafin. This is awesome. Look at that. That's a cool card. Yeah, definitely a fan of the new, the way that they're styling these new cards. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and open another booster pack. We're halfway through, guys. Thanks for hanging in there. All right, let's start with this guy right here. Okay, that one opened up a lot easier compared to how they usually do. So that's cool there. Ooh. And okay, had one of these guys in there. So let's see. Let's see if it's another water-based Pokemon or if it's like a completely different random card. I've always been curious if the um you know what what what's printed if that actually matters uh, and there's some way to predict what type of card is there uh, or there is all right so let's see there's the pokemon card and oh cool that's an awesome energy i think that's what um hip, hypno or uh, I'm, I'm not sure i could be getting that wrong a psychic energy i'm not sure but anyway there's a steeny another whooper we might give some of these cards away, guys. So if you you know are missing any of these cards, please um, you know let us know. We might we might do a giveaway on some of these. But we've got a ball toy on here, a Carvana. That is cool. I wonder if Carvana stole the name from this Pokemon. That'd be interesting to see. Sharp Fang. That's awesome. A Togetti. Nice or Togetic. Togetic. I know I'm probably saying it wrong, but 
I'm excited. I've got now I've got both of the Pokemon. I've got the uh, stage one Pokemon and stage two Pokemon. So that's super exciting. All right. And nine tails. That's awesome. That's another um, upgrade stage Pokemon from the Eevee, I believe. And a pull T Geist. I have this card also on Trick or Trade. It's a very cool card. A Houndor. And I believe I might have this card also on Trick or Trade, which, again, another very neat card. I can see why they decided to choose specific cards for that um, that bundle. Okay, we've got a Clefairy. That Pokemon always reminds me of Kirby. Every time, every time. And that background or the grass, like, that looks real. That's crazy. Actually, the whole Pokemon looks real. Looks like it's real plastic. I don't know. That's really cool. But anyway, let's see what we got here. Oh, another purple card. Mind pen. <gasps> don't tell me. A clay doll. Okay, I didn't I didn't um think it was going to be this one. That's a cool card though. Look at that. Very, very pretty. Very hypnotic. Alright. Moving on over to the final pack. For tonight, anyway. Let's see. Gotta catch them all. Yeah, we do. Gotta collect them all. <laughs> Just who knew uh, collecting these could get so expensive. I mean, especially given the fact that there's so many different variants of cards of different Pokemon. Like, that's wild. Can for sure get expensive. I can see how. Oh, nice. I just, I love the cover art on this. I really do. It's it's my favorite. I almost want to not open it, and I want to, like, frame these two together and just display it. That would be so sick. That would be so cool. Might have to find, like, somehow to get an extra one. Or I guess I could always open the pack, but I think there's a, an, a certain appeal to not having an open pack, you know, just having it closed graded i mean it's so pretty you know and graded and plaqued like it's a very very pretty uh this one's very pretty man all right i'm, I'm about to ruin it right now and i'm sorry if i'm going off of uh like if i'm if i feel like if you guys feel like i'm uh, sorry if i'm derailing the train a bit um i am very tired i i do uh basically only get limited uh, time to make these videos and i really want to just get into youtubing it's something i've always wanted to do but you know never actually i'd post a video and then i'd, I'd not do anything with it for years uh, or for like over a year and then i'd post another one and actually i think i created like a couple other channels as well um so i and i don't even know how that works but uh yeah just various times i wanted to get back into YouTubing because I've always wanted to do this like just you know for fun and not not really I know there's the monetary gain if you're like a really huge channel but for me like this this helps like it's it's like relaxing it helps um I don't know what the right word is but it basically helps get my mind right and I really enjoy it um so I'm gonna continue posting videos and um you know if anybody watches this um, and you happen to give me a thumbs up. It's super encouraging. Or if you happen to be like a new subscriber, it's just, it's super awesome. It's encouraging. Um, and I really like the online community, but uh, anyway, let's get back into checking these cards out. So we've got a whooper. Oh, but what I was getting at was, um, I sometimes only get time to, um, uh, record during the night. So here, we're going to go through this just because my camera is getting a little hot right now. And um, I, I'm going to need to uh, stop recording here before it cuts off. Um, so I'm sorry about the uh, low video quality. But anyway, of a room, an Umbrium. Let's get through it. A Poppy, Lunatune, Larvesta. Nice. And again, I'm sorry, guys. I just, I'm going to, oh, man, and I did the reveal too soon. Oh, that is cool. I've never seen a great energy card before, I don't think. Um, it's just super cool. But a Palafin. 
which we got that card, I think, on the on the last deck. Uh, but that's exciting. We've got an extra one. So again, if one of you guys wants it, just let us know or let me know. Thank you. Bye.